So first, we're just going to create a text box. So type in mText for a multi-line text box. I'm just going to key in 100 and click out of it. All right. So now to go back in, just double click it. And then when you double click it, your AutoCAD will open up this ribbon automatically text editor. So to add in a symbol, we want to make this 100 degrees. So add in a degree symbol. Symbol. Simply click this button here, and you select degrees. If you wanted to have a measurement that's you know maybe 100 meters, and you wanted to make it plus or minus a certain tolerance. We'll say plus or minus 10. We'll make it one meter plus or minus 10 mils. This is a tolerance. Simply under symbol, click plus minus again. Also, if you aren't happy with this text style, you can just um, highlight the text that's in there. Oop. Double click in there, select everything. Then under this formatting, in this formatting area, you can select text and you can find any style that you want. I'm just going to select Arial. There's lots of other symbols that you can enter in. Almost equal to, Delta, Nautic equal to angle diameter then if there's other symbols that aren't in this list then come down here select other and what that does that opens up the character map which is just a windows program if you hit start type in character map you can open it there as well um, then you can just scroll down then you can just scroll down here and find any symbol that you did want. So you might want the copyright symbol. So we'll copy it. So we selected that to bring it down to there. We select copy. Then over here we just control V to paste it. Alright, well I hope you found this useful. That's how you can enter in any symbol or character into AutoCAD such as degrees, plus or minus, diameter or angle, delta and and any other symbol that you could possibly want to insert. And that's done in the NAA multiple line text object. If it was just a plain text, if it was just a plain single line text object, which is brought it, which is created just by typing in text. So if you double click on it, it doesn't bring up that same text tool that did that did come up when you um, double click the M text thing, but you can still enter in symbols just by using this character map. Like uh, if you wanted that to be five degrees, you find the degree symbol, you select that, press copy, and you come over here, and you can control V and paste it in there. So that's how you insert symbols and characters into mText and text objects in AutoCAD.